Hello everyone, my name is Christina and thanks for joining me in this 30 day yoga series of Yoga with Intention. So we've made it to day 22. Uh, I can't believe it, it's been flying by, but at the same time, it feels like it's been a long journey. Um, but I hope you guys are learning tons of tools and implementing them into your own yoga practice. So for day 22, it's vinyasa flow. This whole series is, um, has been me um, creating sequences for you guys and that you will call that a vinyasa. So vinyasa is connecting the breath with each movement. So there's a breath for each movement. Usually an inhale is an upper movement, you know, inhaling through the spine and an exhale is a downward movement or like a twist. So yeah, just keep that in mind when um, you're taking a, uh, a class that says vinyasa, it usually means the, you know, a sequence of yoga poses linked together and using your breath to really guide that practice. So, all right, I hope you guys are ready and I'll see you on the mat. All right, you guys, so we are going to start at the top of our mat. We're gonna feel our feet grounded. So kind of carrying on from what we learned about balance yesterday, um, when you are, you know, sinking and going from one pose to the next, I want you to think of grounding through your base of your feet. So that is your quality of your pose is all about how you are really grounded, you know, in your feet. Or if you are doing arm balances, you know, really fully expressing through the um, shoulders, the arms, the back muscles, the palms, right? All right, so we're gonna go ahead and bring your feet together. You're gonna take a deep breath in, extend through the arms through, you know, at the top of your head. Fingers together, palms together, suck in the lower belly. Exhale, bring your hands towards your heart. And then set the intention of really going through each movement, one breath at a time, experiencing each breath, experiencing each moment, allowing yourself to be present. Allowing yourself to be in that flow state. Allowing your mind and your body to sink with your breath. All right, so you take an inhale through the nose and exhale forward fold. Always start off with the warm up and then sun salutation. Inhale, open up your chest. And exhale, bend your knees, bring your feet back into a high plank. Good, inhale, shift your weight forward. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, upper facing dog, open up your chest. Exhale, downward facing dog. Then feel the stretch in the back of your legs. Take a deep breath in and exhale. Good, deep breath in and deep breath out. Good, two more, inhale. Lower belly in, exhale. Ujjayi breath, inhaling through the nose and exhaling through the nose. Last one, inhale and exhale. Good. We're going to bend your knees, look up, keep your tailbone up. We're going to go ahead and hop your feet towards your hands. Inhale, open up your chest and exhale for food. Good. Inhale, extend your arms overhead, palms together. And exhale, really feel that breath go through your body. So, guys, I really want you to take your time with your practice. You don't have to rush the movements. I want you to really feel your body, take in the whole experience, okay? So you take an inhale through the nose and just play with the movements. See what works and what feels good for you, too. Good. Inhale, open up your chest into half fold. Exhale, bend your knees, pop your feet back into a high plank, right? Feel your hands and palms grounded, press away from the mat, shoulder blades away from each other. Inhale, shift your weight forward, chaturanga. Inhale, upper facing dog, open up your chest. You can even lift your chin up. And then exhale, bring your hips up and back. Good. Take a deep inhale and exhale. Good, inhale through the nose and exhale. Good, deep breath in and deep breath out. Good, last one, inhale and exhale. Good, when I look up, keep your tailbone lifted. 
Lift your legs, good. Inhale, open up your chest. Exhale, forward fold. Good. Inhale, slowly roll your arms all the way up and over your head. And exhale, bring your hands towards your heart. Good, we're gonna do that again. Inhale, extend your arms overhead. Exhale, forward fold, drop your head. Good, inhale, open chest. Exhale, bend your knees, palms down, go into a high plank. Good, inhale, shift your weight forward. Exhale, chaturanga. Good, so sometimes people really rush through that chaturanga. I really want you to take your time. Even if it's like a slow burn, really feel that chaturanga into your upper facing dog. I want you to take a deep breath in and exhale, release. Good, inhale through the nose and exhale. Good, inhale through the nose and exhale. Good, last one, deep breath in and deep breath out. Good, I want you to bring your feet together. Good, I want you to roll your, um, like lift up your upper body, come into a high plank. Good, and I want you to come all the way down onto your belly. Lift into your upper facing dog with your knees down, open up your chest. Good, squeeze your glutes. And then I want you to come down, bring your arms beside you. I'm gonna lift up our um, toes off the mat, interlace your fingers, come down, exhale. Inhale, lift your chest, right? So sinking the breath for each movement. Exhale, come down. Inhale, extend through the spine. Good, tailbone down, lift your chest, shoulder heads back, exhale, come down. Good, inhale, lift. Good, and exhale down. Last one, inhale, lift. Good, exhale, bring your palms right by your rib cage into an upper facing dog, open up your chest. And then exhale, we're gonna go into a child's pose. Good, take a deep breath in and exhale. Good, deep breath in through the nose and exhale. Good, last one, inhale and exhale. Good, and then come all the way back and onto your, um, down into your upper facing dog, open up your chest. Good, and you're gonna come all the way down. You're gonna lift your right ankle, heel to butt. Really get that heel towards your butt, take a deep breath in, keep your chest open, and exhale, squeeze your glutes, get your tailbone down. Good, inhale through the nose, and exhale. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Good, last one, inhale and exhale. Good, we're gonna go ahead and do the other side. And bring your, grab onto your ankle from the inside or the outside, doesn't matter. We're gonna think heel to bed, squeeze your glutes, tailbone down, open up your chest, shoulder away from the neck. Good, take an inhale through the nose and exhale. Good, legs together. Inhale through the nose and exhale. Good, last one, deep breath in and deep breath out. Good, I'm gonna come all the way back down and curl your toes under and then sit on the balls of your, I mean, sit on your toes here, stretch out your feet, get in your heels, soles of your feet. You're gonna take a deep breath in and exhale here. Good, we're gonna come all the way back. Extend your arms like Superman. You can even use a block, help you to keep your palms, squeeze the block with your palms, arms in line with your ears, good, and then come down. So only if you have a block, you know, or a book or something, you can do this exercise. You can do it without the block, just have your palms facing each other, Keep your inner arms in line with your ears. Look down at your mat, come back down. Good, inhale, lift, because you don't want to lift your head up because that breaks the neck and puts a lot of pressure in your neck. So you want to keep your arms in line with your ears. Keep that spine nice and aligned from your crown all the way down towards your tailbone. Good, take a deep breath in. Good, and then exhale, reach those fingertips far as your toes go back, and then exhale, come down. Good. Very nice. This time we're gonna go ahead and take your right ankle. Good. 
And then you're gonna take your left ankle, squeeze your glutes. You can bring your knees out a little further, point your toes or your big toes are facing, you know, each other, touching. And you're gonna extend your feet. You're gonna think toes, lift them up towards the ceiling as your chest, your sternum lifts and your shoulder heads back. Good, take a deep inhale here, extend through the spine. And then exhale, I want you to come all the way back into your Superman. <laughs> Yeah, so this is really doing a number on your back extenders. Grab your ankles, take a deep breath in, and then exhale, go back into your Superman. Keep your toes lifted, point your toes back, fingertips up, forward. I'm gonna do that again. Inhale, lift. So there's the vinyasa, right? And then exhale, Superman. Good. Inhale into your will. So grab your, your ankles, Open up your chest. Good, squeeze your glutes, tailbone down. Exhale into Superman. Good, last one. Grab your ankles, lift your toes up. Good, shoulder heads back. And then exhale, bring your palms right by your rib cage into your upper facing dog. Open up your chest. Knees off the mat, good. And then exhale, curl your toes under into downward facing dog. Good, I want you to take a deep breath in and exhale, release. Good, inhale through the nose and exhale. Good, deep breath in and deep breath out. You're gonna bring your feet together, heels down. Good, you're gonna lift your right leg up and go ahead and bring your right foot in between your hands, seal that back heel down. We're gonna go into your warrior one. Good, take a deep inhale through the nose. Exhale into warrior two. Nice, we're gonna go ahead. We're gonna reach forward. You're gonna bind, grab your wrist or your ankle. You probably would have heard like a pop <laughs> in my shoulder, but you're really stretching out your shoulder. So you wanna draw your left shoulder head back. Keep that back leg straight. Good, open up the chest. Good. We're gonna unwrap and go back to our warrior two. All about balance here. Good, take a deep inhale, lift your back leg up into that half moon. Good. You're gonna reach your fingertips down, come onto your finger pods. You can also use a block or a book. I'll go ahead and grab that. For those who wanna use a block or a book, extend the arms, right, into a T-shape. Really fighting here, yeah? Good. Come back into your warrior two. Nice. Good. We're gonna go right into, we're gonna go into our crescent lunge. Open up your chest. Take a deep breath in. You're gonna go right into your warrior three. Good. Open chest. You know, bring your toes back, draw the navel in. Good. We're gonna go ahead and come into like, lift that left leg up, hold that. Good, take a deep breath in. Keep your left hand down and extend the right arm twist. Good, feel that stretch there. Good, open and twist. We're gonna come all the way down into our crescent lunge, but we're gonna continue to stay there. Bring that right hand down onto the back of your leg and lift that left arm up. Good, open up your chest. Nice, good. And then you're gonna come all the way back down. You're gonna bring your left knee down, uncurl your toes, good. And then we're gonna go back and lift our arms up into Anjanasana, open up that chest. Good, very good. And exhale, forward fold. You wanna walk your hands back into a half split here. If you want, you can go into your full split <laughs> this is a lot, it's a whole sequence here. Take a deep breath in, open up your chest. Squeeze, I mean, keep your navel into spine. Good, exhale here. You can come back, you can curl your back toe under, bring your front foot to meet your back foot, go into your downward facing dog. Good, take a deep breath in. I'm gonna lift your left leg up. Now we're gonna do the other side. <laughs> Bring your left foot in between your hand. Good. And you're gonna go ahead, 
seal that back heel down inhale into your warrior one and open up your chest good exhale come into your warrior two nice hopefully i remember what i just did if you want you can get your heel toe get your warrior two out a little wider yeah feel that nice openness in your inner thigh knee on top of the ankle back leg is straight yep good take a deep breath in we're going to go into our half moon i believe that's what we did if not it's okay <laughs> good open chest into our half moon Ooh, and then come back might have screwed the um order but it's okay take a deep breath in we're going to go ahead and bind into our warrior two yeah, so we're gonna go ahead and take our hand, um, take the right hand, flip the palm, bring it back, grab onto your wrist, your left wrist, or your hand, and pull and open up your chest. Good. So you take a deep breath in, open. Good. Inhale through the nose, keep that back leg straight and open. Good. Inhale through the nose, exhale, twist. Good. Last one. Inhale through the nose and exhale, twist. Good. You're going to come back into your warrior two. Nice, you guys. It's crazy, right? Nice. You want to and continue to engage in your core, squeeze the glutes. Yeah? Good. Take a deep breath in and exhale. We're going to go ahead and rotate into our crescent lunge here good take a deep inhale through the nose and exhale we're going to go into our warrior three good we're going to drop our hands down keep that right leg lift nice good if you want you can go ahead bring that leg down and keep your right hand in front and twist so suck in the lower belly inhale and exhale twist open up your chest Woo! Keep that back leg straight and twist, lifting your fingertips up towards the ceiling. Nice arms, strong arms. Good. You're gonna come down back onto the ball of that back foot, the right foot. Good. And you're gonna lift into a twist like a crescent lunge, a reverse here. Keep that back leg straight. Open up your chest. Good. Now you're gonna go ahead, cartwheel those arms, bring your right knee down, uncurl your toe. Good, take a deep inhale, extend your arms up and over into Anjanasana. Open up your chest, draw the navel in. Good, Ex exhale, bring your palms down, walk your hands back. As you lift your left toes up, keep your chest nice and open. Good, take a deep breath here and exhale, feel Back of your legs really going, right? If you want, optional, heels forward, that left heel forward. Keep lifting your chest open and drop your tailbone down into your split. Good, take a deep breath in, chest open, exhale. Good, last one, deep inhale and exhale, open chest. Good, you can curl your back toe under, lift 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 your hips up bring your front foot to meet your back foot good and go back into your downward facing dog good take a deep breath in and an exhale good inhale through the nose and exhale good you're going to walk your hands forward into a high plank good we're going to start with our left palm into center we're going to Vashistasana, Vashistasana, sorry, Vashistasana. Extend the arm, fingertips lifting up through the arms. You want to lift through the armpits and the hips up as well. Good. And then you're going to come back into your high plank. We're going to try the other side. Right palm into the middle, it's midline. Extend the left arm all the way up. Good. Your arm should be in a nice line. You should be lifting through the hips up towards the ceiling, keeping your core nice and engaged. Good, come back to center into the high plank. Very good, we're almost there. Lift your left leg up and then right leg, right arm. Good, find your balance. See if you can bring knee to elbow. 
yes, and extend. Woo, and try the other side. This is all core. So you keep your feet nice and grounded. Ball the foot, you wanna extend the right leg up. Keep your, now extend your right arm. Good. Knee to elbow. Good, and extend. Yes, and then come down. Good, you're gonna vinyasa. <laughs> Inhale, upward facing dog. And exhale, downward facing dog. Good. Take a deep breath in and then exhale. Good. And bring your knees down and go into child's pose. So that was a great practice. Good. Inhale through the nose and exhale, just really release, let it go. Good. Very good. Keep your arms nice and strong, palms are planted. Take a deep inhale and exhale. Good. I'm gonna come all the way up. You're gonna go into Pashimottasana. So toes up, palms right by your rib, I mean by your hips. Open up your chest, chin down. Good. Take a deep inhale and exhale. Good. If this is hard for you, you can do this on the with your back on the wall. Extend your arms up and over, or you can sit on like a blanket to elevate your hips up, yeah? Or you can just bend your knees, or you're gonna interlace your fingers, or grab your wrists. Keep your toes up too. You don't wanna drop your feet, you know, your toes down, or have your feet not um, engaged. You wanna keep your toes up, Those the, fo the foot is flex, both feet. Good, take a deep breath in. Think chest towards your thigh, head towards your shin. Inhale through the nose and exhale. Good. Three more. Inhale. Exhale. Two more. Inhale. Exhale. Last one. Inhale. Exhale. Good. Inhale. Lift your chest. Good. Open chest and then exhale. Release. Good. Janu Shirsasana, we're going to bring our right foot in the inside. Good. And extend the arm up and over your head. And you can grab, take your right hand, grab your left wrist, open up your chest. Your deep breath in, exhale forward, fold chest towards your thigh, head towards your shin. Inhale through the nose and exhale. Good. Inhale through the nose and exhale. Good. Good, deep inhale, and exhale, navel into spine. Last one, inhale, and exhale. Good, inhale, open up your chest, exhale, release. We usually go ahead and do a vinyasa, but it's okay for, since this is a very fast practice, we're just gonna go right into the next. So you can bring your left foot in the inside of your thigh, Keep your toes up, extend the arms overhead. Exhale, grab your right wrist with your left hand. Take a deep breath in, open up your chest. Exhale, forward fold. Chest towards your thigh, head towards your shin. Inhale through the nose and exhale. Good, deep breath in, deep breath out. Good, keep your toes lifting up towards the ceiling. Inhale, heel forward. Exhale, good, last one, deep inhale, and deep exhale through the nose, good, inhale, open up your chest, exhale, release, good, all right, and come on to our backs, good, and bring your knees in towards your chest, and drop your shoulders, relax the back of your head, take a deep inhale, and deep exhale, Good. Inhale through the nose and exhale. Good. Last one. Deep breath in and deep breath out. Good. And go into happy baby. Grab your big toe. Open up your hips. Good. Take a deep inhale. Drop your shoulders. Relax the back of your head. Good. Navel in towards the spine. Good. Inhale through the nose. And exhale, good, inhale through the nose, 
and exhale. Good, last one, deep breath in and deep breath out. Good, and go ahead and bring your soles of your feet together like Spider-Man. Good, just open up those hips. Yeah, you can feel the back of your you know, lower back and opening up the lower back there. And go ahead and bring your soles of your feet down. Open up your arms to the side or place your palms on your chest and your tummy. Just allow your hips to open. Connect with your breath. So feel the inhale. Feel the exhale. Notice all your senses. Taste, touch, smell, sight, sound. Take a deep inhale and exhale, release. Yeah, you can slowly bring your knees in, take your time, arms out into a T shape, move your knees to the right, move your knees to the left. Good, we're gonna go ahead and bring your legs all the way out. Straighten out the arms, shoulder blades in and down your back. So your arms like in a diagonal, relax your feet. Your back of your head, your shoulders, your shoulder blades, your tummy. And just take it one breath at a time. Good. Just feel your whole body becoming more relaxed with each breath. Surrendering, allowing the flow of your energy to pass through effortlessly from your crown all the way down towards your toes. Now do go ahead and start to wiggle your fingers and your toes. And then you can roll yourself onto your right side just to get the circulation back into your body. Good, and take your time with, it, with this here. And you can slowly lift yourself all the way up. Okay, you can move your neck all the, way, all the way around just to loosen up your neck. And then we'll go ahead and roll your shoulders back. Good. Now go ahead and take a deep breath in, extend your arms up and over, exhale, bring that energy towards your heart center. I just want you to think of something you're grateful for, bringing gratitude in your thoughts. I want you to seal that gratitude in your heart. Take a deep inhale and exhale, release it. Good. Thank you so much, you guys. I hope that helped you today. That was generally a, what a vinyasa flow looks like. It's a sequence of yoga poses put together and you're syncing the breath with each movement. So you can come back to this uh, page or this, not this page, but this video if you're looking for something that uh, work with balance, strength, and flexibility because I covered about all of that. And um, I'll see you guys tomorrow. We, we are going to be at day 23 and make sure you guys get plenty of rest and, you know, stay hydrated and enjoy the rest of your day. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. All right.